I know if you if you if you're somebody, you know you've been praying, you've been fasting, you've been asking God what, why, when, where, how. You need to hear this and you need to share this. By accident. So several months ago, and I'll, I'll get right into it because this is this is interesting. So so actually, not even several months ago, about two and a half years ago, number in mind. Um, God gave me this prophetic dream. And I, I shared it with a bunch of people. So this is this is going on record. I've actually shared this dream before on social media. And God gave me this prophetic dream about two and a half years ago. And in the dream, God showed me a storm was coming. And uh, it was all over the news. And, and from that storm that was coming, I pulled over on the side of the road and I began to do a live video. And my video had 44 million views. Is the which I believe was symbolic. It's hit 30 then God to 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 took me to another part of the dream so he does where people were gathered in the church, but there was something brewing in the church. And this guy that I saw in the dream is a pastor, very well known, and he got up and ran out of the sanctuary, and people ran after him. They, they, it was like a mass exodus out of the church, out of this mega church. It just takes a little bit of time to put it all together and and uh, I remember, and you got to hear this because this is one of the most profound parts of what I'm about to share. I shared it with a very trusted friend of mine who's very prophetic, and I had written a book, and I'm going to show you the book I've written, and I'm going to tell you what, what I'm about to share with you. I've written this book called Unmasking the Accuser, and I'm not trying to advertise this. I'm going to tell you why I'm sharing this with you in a minute. I wrote a book called Unmasking the Accuser, and, and the subtitle of the book was How to Fight Satan's Favorite Lie, and this person told me something that made me mad. They said, Dr. Keenan, they said, your book is not, they said, there's something coming, but there's a message attached to what you're going to share in your book. It's not even just this, this print of the book, there's going to be something coming later that's going to address a major issue in the body of Christ. And I said, oh my God, I didn't want to hear that because I wanted to sell my books. And God said, no. No, no, no. The church wasn't ready for the message when you released it. They weren't ready for it. They weren't ready for it. This is probably, some people say this was the best book I ever wrote, but but people weren't ready for what I was exposing. What I was exposing in the book. And let me go back to the 